This is the life of Mike Breen. My name is Michael Breen. I was born on January 28, 1993 in Riverview Medical Center in Red Bank, New Jersey. My parents are originally from New York, but moved to Hazlitt together in 1989 and had my older sister, Danielle, a year later. I have lived in Hazlitt since the day I was born. In 1994, my other sister, Joanna, was born. At age 5, 1998, I started to play roller hockey. At first, I honestly was terrible, but a couple years later, I'd be one of the better players in the game. A year later, I started to go camping. First, we started out camping in a tent and slowly moved up into an RV and to a bigger RV. I still go camping today and have been from Maine to Florida and as far west as California in my RV. As a child, I attended many schools in Hazlitt because of redistricting. First, I went to Raritan Valley from kindergarten to second grade. Then I attended Beer Street Elementary School up until sixth. For seventh and eighth grade, I went to the Hazlitt Middle School. By this time, in my, in my life, my roller hockey hobby turned into more of a competitive sport. I first started off by making Team New Jersey at age 13, and then I began to also play with a club team called the New Jersey Salt. In 2006, we won a national championship, and we were the best 1993 AAA team in the nation. A year later, the team fell apart, and I had to go searching for a new team. In 2008, Team New Jersey placed second in State Wars, but to this day, we still have not won the gold. State Wars is a roller hockey organization that allows you to try out for your state. Then if you make the team, you'll play kids from all across the country. At age 15, my, my team became sponsored by Mission Hockey, which means that we get discounted items as well as free gloves, pants, and other items. I love to play video games, and ever since Halo came out for Xbox, I really love to play. Uh, to this day, I play Call of Duty, Killzone 2, the Halo series, and sports games for Xbox 360 and PS3. I played soccer for Raritan High School since my freshman year. I really enjoy playing the sport and have fun while I do it. In the winter and spring, I, I run track for Raritan. I run the 400, the 800, and the 4x4 relay. In 2009, I broke my wrist in four places while playing hockey in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I broke it right above the gold plate and split the bone in two. I was in a cast for six weeks and got it off this past year. The worst part was when the doctor had to reset my wrist, which hurt like crazy. This summer, I practiced a lot for soccer and also went on vacation to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, which was a blast. Today, I'm a junior at Raritan High School. Hey. So, Mom, what was I like as a kid? You were a really good baby. Um, you slept through the night very, very quickly. Probably, like, by three or four weeks, you were sleeping through the night. You would, uh, the only thing I do remember that was nasty was that you had acid reflux as a kid and you used to, like, throw up projectile <laughs> right after a feeding. <laughs> that I remember, that was horrible. <laughs> that lasts for like a couple months. Um, probably until you were like three months old. But um, you know, it just kept at it and you got better and you used to be able to drink the whole bottle and not, you know, spit it all back up. Um, I used to um, love that you were so easy. You didn't cry a lot, you weren't cranky. It was just, just a pleasure to have around. Um, you also were really quick to potty train. Um, I was able to send you to school at two and a half to uh, the Creative Campus at a special school, a special um, uh, class for two and a half year old children. I guess in, probably in just two, two and a half year old. I sent you that September. So I, that was very great because I got a chance to only have uh, one child home for a little while, your younger sister, because it was real tough when you all were little. Having three children under five is very tough. So, Mama, who was the best child? Oh, yes, well, Mike, you know how I feel about that. You being my only boy and all, I do get on your sister's cases a lot and tell them how you're my favorite. But, of course, there are no favorites in this house. There's just, I love you all equally the same. <laughs> but you are my only boy. And you are an easy baby. As you got older, you started to get into trains. You 
loved your trains. Loved times the tank engine. Train, train, train. We went to Pennsylvania a couple times just to go to the train museums. Um, I got tons of pictures of you in front of trains, in trains, playing with trains. That was your big thing um, for a long time. And then as you got oh, even older, I guess your favorite toys were like Hot Wheels um, and Legos. Legos were real big for a long time. Oh my God, have the boxes and boxes and crates of Legos that were in your room so for ages and ages. Um, we used to love building and tinkering with that. Um, let's see. Um, hmm, I gotta think more. Um, okay. Oh, I remember when I first brought you home from, from uh, no, when I first brought Joanna home from the hospital in the car seat and I put her on the floor and you were only a year old, not even a year old probably when I brought Joanna home. Let's see. Joanna, nope, you were 11 months old. And um, you tried to sit in the car seat right on top of Joanna, and I almost had a panic attack. And from that day forward, I used to put Joanna up on the dining room table all the time in her seat because I was afraid you were going to sit on her. Um, let's see. Uh, uh, oh, okay. As you got older, um, as soon as you could, because you were so fascinated by the lawnmower, you started mowing. You couldn't wait to mow. You used to mow. And you were a great help to me and Dad, actually. Like, you did help out a lot. Uh, more than your sisters. Um, but especially with the mowing and, and straightening out outside. You're, and, oh, and another big thing that Mike loves to do is um, decorate at Christmas time. My house is lit up for all of Hazlitt to see because Mike starts at Thanksgiving and we have to buy something. One new thing every year we go and get. He likes to throw all the lights out. It gets, uh, it's really fun and it's, it's really nice that he does that. Okay, Mom, thanks. Okay. So, Joanna, what's it like having an older brother? It's fun. He's like, you're, you're like my protective, like, other parent when mom and dad aren't around. I always make sure I'm okay. And even though when we were younger, we always, like, fought a lot. <laughs> and we'd scream at each other. And that's um, our older sister, but it's all fun. And now we all have the same friends and stuff, so we hang out together a lot. And pretty close. I would think.